Now then, let's go ahead and uh, head on over to Smith Casey's garage, and we'll start heading down towards the tunnel to fight the Enclave remnants and destroy the shit out of them with the Brotherhood of Steel. Alright. The green marker over here. Is it one of my friendly things? Or yep it is. Help him! Oh it's dead. Never mind. That's a death claw over there though, fighting it looks like outcast numbers. Go lend him a hand, shall we? We might actually not get to it by the time we can out. Nope, they already won. Damn. I tell ya, some people. Just don't let me save him. Wait. Of red. Oh, it's oh, talent company merc. Ha ha. Yeah, you son of a bitch. I just saw the black armor. I was thinking, gee, they must be, you know, um, Brotherhood of Outcasts. But nope. Ha ha. We got to kill some talent company mercs. Oh yeah. Let's fuck you guys. You stupid fucking talent company bastards. Never know. Ooh, Nuka Cola, huh? Sierra probably does. Um, Ah, she's the one who wants the quantum, isn't it? Well, hey. hey there, stranger. How's it going? Sierra Petrova does the name. Good to see a new face in Girder Shade. Girder Shade. I take it you're here to check out my new... Nuka-Cola collection? Wow. I have one of the... No. The best Nuka-Cola collection in the Capital Wasteland. Heck, I've won the Nuka-Cola Fan Club Collection Award for the last ten years in a row. Yeah. Yep. I'm the president, the recording secretary, and the treasurer. Once a year, we gather here in Girder Shade to have a cook-off using Nuka Cola and the recipe. Last year, I went with my poached roach and Nuka sauce. Delicious. Mm-hmm. I had members in your club. Well, only two right now, me and Ronald. But membership is open to the public. Who's Ronald? Ronald? Oh, I'm sorry. I figured you met him already. He usually chats with people who enter Girder Shade. Well, that is kind of nice. He's my neighbor and my protector, as he calls it. Imagine if some nasty raider wanted to take my stuff. He'd show them a thing or two. He's such a sweetie. You should talk to him. All right. So you mentioned a tour or something. I sure <laughs> did. How can you res... Let's do it. Well, come on, then. Let me show... All right. When Nuka Cola was invented by John Caleb Radisson in 2044, it quickly became the world's most popular soft drink. That's a huge bottle. The Wonder Drink soon drew a dedicated following, which prompted the Nuka Cola Corporation to release many promotional items like these. Nice. It's a clock. Always time. Wait. Always time for refreshing Nuka. Yeah. By 2067, a Nuka Cola machine such as this rare, pristine model could be found on almost every street in America. Why is it rare? It looks like the same as like every other one that I've seen. Is it rare because it's pristine? It doesn't look pretty pristine to me. It kind of has some dust around the edges and stuff. I don't know. Even in today's crazy world, Nuka Cola is still the number one choice of refreshment among Armageddon survivors. As promised, water. here's a little pick-me-up. An ice-cold Nuka-Cola. Just look at the frost on the bottle. So cold and delicious. Well, Pardon me. <clears throat> I tend to lose myself. Before I get to the little proposition I have for you, let me tell you a little bit about Nuka-Cola Quantum. Quantum. What's the proposition? So impatient. Wow. You must really want to get out there and start looking. Anyway. For every bottle you bring me, I'll pay you some caps. You know, for expenses. But if you're super cool and find, like, enough bottles to fill my Nuka-Cola machine, 30 in all, I got a super secret cool prize for you. Come on, Sierra, no secrets between friends. Oh, okay. I have a schematic for the mm. Nuka Grenade. The only one in the whole capital wasteland. Bring me the Love bottles, already got it. <laughs> and it's yours. <laughs> Imagine the look on the target's face when they are burning alive in an effervescent explosion of cola and fruit flavors. So, what do you say? Will you bring me the bottles? I like her explanation of that. That was great. Um, you got a deal. Oh, goody! I can taste the quantum already. Good luck. So, I, um, happen to have a bunch already. 
It's a Grady. Nope. Sorry. Why did I ask that? Did I? Okay. Anything else of interest near it? Well, to the east, there are some nasty raiders in Evergreen Mills. They're dead. I'd stay away from there if I we're were you. Dead. Luckily, we're kind of hidden here under the old highway, so no one bothers us. Okay. I'm gonna go now. And, uh, I'm not, I guess Lock I can go... For a reason. Don't get any ideas. What's Lock? That? Relax. I'm not gonna take your nuka cola. Hey, oh, God. Uh, what were you doing in Sierra's oh. place? It scared me a little bit. I was checking out her collection. That better be all you were checking out. I don't like guys messing with my woman. Look here, boy. I'm not moving anything. Good. I aim to keep it that way. She's a fine woman. I'd love to get closer to her if you know what I mean. Unrequired love. What are you driving at? Wow, you are as naive. How do I put it? I'd love to do the horizontal bop with her, you know, plow her bean field. Come on, kid. Nope, still don't get it. New to this stuff, huh, kid? Well, let's just say that she has something I want to get a hold of. That's where you enter the picture. Oh, really? I know she's asked you to find her some Nuka Cola Quantum. Heck, she asks everyone that wanders through here. What I'm proposing is you still look for the drinks, but instead of bringing it to her, you bring it to me. She'll be so impressed that I got all the Nuka Cola for her, she'll melt in my arms like butter. I pay you the same she was going to pay, and everyone's happy. How about you pay me double for each quantum bottle? You devious bastard. I didn't figure you were that clever. <laughs> all right, all right, double it is. Just bring me those bottles. If I have to listen to Sierra ramble on any longer, I think I'll blow my brains out. So you gonna do it or what? <laughs> yeah, always looking for making more caps, man. Thought you might. Good. I already got the uh, quantum, not a quantum, the uh, Nuka Cola grenade anyway. So I don't really need it again. Some Brahmin over there, Mrs. Roland's home. Are they the only two inhabitants of this town, by the way? I think they are. That's weird. Hey, Roland, I got your stuff. Bringing me some quantum? Nothing else near it. My friend, you are at the ass end of the capital wasteland. If it weren't for Sierra, I'd be out of here. <laughs> One thing I can tell you is stay the hell away from the Dunwich building to the south. That place is bad, Mojo. Dunwich I don't know place. what that place is about, but I hear about weird... Well, that sounds amazing. Here's all the quantum I'm carrying. Well, this should be enough to fill that stupid machine of hers. Thanks for all your help, but our transaction is done. I'll take any extras off your hands for now, but then I'm done with these disgusting drinks. They taste horrible. Now to put the moves on my lady. I want an expert at work. I'm gonna watch, because it's gonna be funny. Oh, I lost karma! You know what? That's stupid. You're stupid. I don't like you. 3,360 bottle caps. I just want to watch him, like, just totally veil. It's gonna be funny. What's my karma hat now, by the way? I'm so very good. I'm a symbol of honor. Or order, I mean. You know. Ain't nobody care. What? Now's the time for blood. Oh, it's a robot. And it's dead now. Wait for me, man. Hey there, sweet cheeks. I got something for you. Oh my goodness. Are they you them? absolute dear. You found the quantum to fill my machine. Yeah, I'll fill your machine, all right. <laughs> what was that? Nothing. So you want to celebrate? Well, maybe later. I have lots of things to do now. Need to get all this quantum icy cold. That's okay, baby. We have plenty of time. You know where to find me when you want some of this. Some of what? <laughs> That's okay, Sierra. Play hard to get. I so love it. Yup. They sure were hard to get. And you got them, you big old teddy bear. Anyway. Gotta get these into the machine. See ya, sweetie. She's so dumb. Yep, I'll be seeing you soon, I hope. You got something on your mind? Spill it. <laughs> that was horrible, man. What? You suck. Uh. My friend. All right, same old, same old. Let me go ahead and talk to her now. Oh, good. You. Nothing to say. I have no ordeal. Has Roland been bothering you? Oh no, not at all. In fact, 
I've been getting lots of nice attention from him lately. Ever since he brought the quantum to fill my machine, in Hilarious. fact, he told me he's going to butter my muffin. Isn't that sweet? <laughs> that he'll do such a silly little chore for me. Now all I need are muffins. Oh my god. Oh, Jesus. I'm gonna go check I out. I really uh, hope you're not... This place is to the south. Where was that thing at, by the way? The Dunwich building? Oh, I'm heading down to the tunnel route. Wait. Where is... That. Okay, down there. Really good. Look at it. So I'm going to check that out right after I check out the uh, Dunwich building right here. Another albino scorpion. Interesting. Hmm. All right, what kind of crazy science is going on here? Hmm. Ammo at the front door. Oh, and ghouls. Ghouls are nice too. Go ahead and turn the light here. Oh my. Well, we get to listen to some stuff. That's cool. Notes. Why the hell would he come all the way out here? Dad's been a little nuts for some time now, but not like this. Leaving me in that crappy Without a goddamn flashlight. I made enough selling the meds we scrounged to have kept us both fed at the colony for weeks. Now I'm almost out of rations, my shoes are pretty much destroyed, and I'm still chasing you. Too. My last one, I'm gonna get it out. I'm just saying they got for Fox right here, man. <laughs> Holy shit. Something trouble. Yeah, um, I need to trench some yes, equipment because looks like it hurt a little bit. Let's. I'm gonna go ahead and give you like seven of those. So if you need to, you can you know you that will work, right? Jesus. That could have been really bad if I didn't have Fox with me. Anyhow. Next log. This guy's no, that Maybe one. I shouldn't have waited so damn long to start tracking him. Trail's gone cold. I'm gonna wander with these guys a while. They say they wander the area. Maybe somebody's seen Dad. Maybe I shouldn't have waited. These guys aren't who I thought they were. Jesus, they killed that family for a sack of rotten vegetables. I'm getting out of here next chance I can without catching a bullet. And the next one, number uh, four. I made a caravan today. Trev didn't see the kid and got popped. I took care of Tawny right then and put one in Thor before he saw her fall. That well, earned some grub from the traitors. Even better, they saw Dad. Not he was in pretty rough shape and still has the goddamn book. The trader says it gave him the creeps. Me too. But it's good to know he's still alive. He's still headed south. Interesting. He must have been trying to trap food here. I recognize his snares. I can make out a building on the horizon. That must be where he headed. If not, at least I get a roof tonight. God, I his body. All right. And then last but not least, number six journal. I don't like the look of this place. I don't like the smell. It gives me the creeps. I don't want to risk a shot at the crows till I know what's in there. Sneaking in tonight. And that's all the journal entries for now. So he snuck in here. Looks like he uh, didn't make it very far though. And uh, the ghouls must have gotten him. Which is not surprising. Oh look. Looks like someone was trying to uh, make a last stand here. Didn't work out very well for them though, unfortunately. Oh well, all their ammo will go to a good cause. Me. And the land mines, and all that good stuff. If they had all these mines, why didn't they put them down? That's my question here. Maybe they did, and they just like ran out of space to put them. That's crazy. You're my white fox, come on. What are you doing? Alright. Just a bathroom. Head out this way first. I think there was a red mark over this way. Hello? Knock knock? Hmm. Got him. 
This thing's booby trapped. Can I disarm it? Defuse it. Got it. There was a grenade in there. Huh. I think this is the first time I've ever been able to uh, disarm properly. Oh, fuck! Get him! The fuck is going right at me? Are you kidding? Let me just go ahead and back up here. Jesus Christ. Get him, Fox! Get him! I'm running away! A lot needs some packs here. You good, Fox? Yeah, you good. Let's get those, uh, not you. Come on. Try to find the body here. I think I gave him stim packs. That could have been, uh, quite bad. Alright, so back this way. Oh, hi there. What are you doing? I don't know where he came from. <laughs> Nothing in here. Jeez. Let's do that. Which leads back in that computer room. Yeah, it's like it. Hmm. A bunch of doors to the same place, it looks like. I go downstairs. We don't finish checking this floor before we go anywhere else. He's dead. Rear panel, defuse it. Go. I wonder who's setting all those traps. People who were here before me, or the ghouls, maybe. <laughs> Regardless. Any machines with a gold in it? That's great. I will reload here. Fucking door. Anything in here? No, just more doors heading back to the same place. That's always great, isn't it? Oh, this place is just like one huge square around a square, isn't it? That's kind of funny. Well, we can go down the stairs now, I suppose. Check things out there. Oh, where are the stairs? There we go, there they are. Fox will catch up. He's fast. Hmm, large open area down here. Broken that way. We can line the scrap, I don't think so. Alright, so we got uh, this door here. It's a really open room, I don't like it. Alright, there's another uh, recording here. Let's go ahead and check that out. Alright. Notes. Number seven. Raiders told spook stories about zombies in the ruins. Never anything like that where I come from. Lord help me. They're real. Not quite what Thor said, but close. These things look... I think they really used to be people. Whoa! Okay. That was certainly weird. Yeah, so, um... He was commenting on the ghouls, how they happened to, uh... Ow! Fuck, dude! How they happen to, um, have been people before. I know you're out and that is a thing. Alright. This might be bad. Um, he was upstairs, so I'm assuming he's gonna come down and try to get us here, so... Why don't we try and lay some traps here, quick? Uh, One more. Go! Let's pull out my, uh, Gelling laser again. Ha! Ah, got it! But was it the one I was trying to get? Was it the That is the question here. It was not! It was not! That's the Reaper! This might tickle a little bit, Fox. Sorry. His ass! His ass! Good gosh. You're right, man. You look alright. I'm really glad I haven't ran into that bug where uh, the Reavers happen to go immortal and I can't kill them. That'd be really bad. Oh, it's normal terminal. It will be trapped again. Yeah, I'm not gonna read that. All right, let's check the rest of this floor. There's nothing else here. I think it's just uh, yeah, okay. Crap. 
That was bad. Let's try that again. Does that not fall back down? Okay. There's another ghoul somewhere. I heard it like going at me. Alright, where's the lock at? Is it this way? Oh my god! There should be a store that sells bobby pins, really. Jeez. Stop moving. You're freaking me out, man. The dead should stay dead. So we got some medical tubing, books, nothing else over there. That guy got fucked. Hey, Fox. Okay. You can go ahead and stay there while I look around. I'm still concerned about that vision I just had in that last room I was in. Oops. Not here. Fine here. Turn on number 10, huh? Or 9. Blah. Not 10. Let me uh, take a look around. I heard hissing, but I don't see hissing. Oh, this thing goes down really far. Um, I'll come back here later. For now, I'm going to check out the rest of the, uh, this floor here. That's what you get for hissing! And what's here? Nothing. Alright. Never mind, I guess we're going in that room and going down. I had to go to the last one, you know. But first, we have some recordings to listen to. Found Dad today. I didn't think it was him, but the face. The zombies didn't touch him. I think he was becoming like them. Didn't know it was him until I found that old book here. No more killing. I just need to go. Can't forget the book. All I have left of him. It's warm against the stone. I'll... I'll just rest a while. Did... He just turn into a ghoul? His voice sounded really ghoul-like at the end there. Um, this could be really, really bad. Radiation seems to be going up as I get down. Uh, this could be bad. I don't think Fox is able to get down here either. Missed it. Fine! I'll go this way. Don't hide from me! You can run, but you'll only die tired. Oh, how'd you get down there, Fox? You alright? Jeez. Alright, we had a normal recording soon. Sharp knife. Sharp knife to send him to Deep Temple. Flay and say, my words. Abdul comes again on the feast of the weaker. Feast for the Deep Temple. Born again. Here. El Hazard! Yes! Yes! I think he started to go mad. That's unfortunate. Nothing else back here. No? Alright. Marker over that way, though. Careful, Fox. We're entering some uh, close quarters here. Things could go really bad if we encounter a Reaver down here. Look here, golden one. Stop it. What are you firing at back there? You didn't even have a line of sight, man. Oh, hey. Didn't notice that back there. Um, let me check up here quick. Or let me look at the uh, local map here. Looks like that's a way now, so I think I want to go... I don't know. I'm not entirely sure. Look this way quick. Yeah. Goes into another area, so let's check down here first. Back this way. Another door. Ooh. Deep into a cave, it looks like. Well. You with my fox? Alright. No oh, fuck. There's a Reaver, and then there's Jamie. And there's Fox. Alright. Um. See my weaponry here. 
don't have any more mines. It's unfortunate. Alright, Fox, let's do this. I just gained karma. Don't know why. I did, though. Take him out, Fox! Take him out! Do with everything you got. Take him out, Fox! Take him out! Shoot him until he can't shoot no more! Woo! Alright. Biggest threat to dead. That's good. Take him out, Fox! Yeah, you got him. Good job, my friend. Good job. One more down here. Careful. There he is. Just a roamer, though. Alright. Looking good. Looking good. So, Jamie, how's it going? Why did I have a finger from him? He wasn't that bad of a person, was he? Is there any more uh, recordings down here? I wish we should give this one more recording. Like, summarizing things, you know? Telling me why he, like, somehow got bad or something. Whoa. That's... That's interesting. Um... Hmm. Anything else down here? Don't think there is. Huh. I thought for sure he'd have another recording of some sort. This is crazy. This is... The fuck? What the hell is this? What the fuck? This is pretty weird. I'm not gonna lie. Like, all the weird things I've seen in Fallout. Holy fuck. Alright. Get the fuck out of here. And here I was hoping for some epic conclusion with Jamie or something like that. Something that was like, yeah, so. Or explaining the purpose of that obelisk right there. That was weird. Hmm. Regardless, I have some doors to go through, it looks like. Ah, this puts me up to this floor, which is right before a point somewhere. I don't know. Nothing else here? Fair enough. Alright. Where am I at now? Ah! Here. Where I took the first where you were at, right? Yep, yeah, alright. Alright, Fox, I'm pretty sure this place has uh, been cleared out. So let's, um, check the wasteland, chambers, all these ruins, yeah. Alright, Fox, we're getting out of here. Heading to the tunnels to fight the Enclave now. Let's head on out. That was an experience. 